to officially downgrade from iOS 18 to iOS 17 without data loss, first you need to back up your device. Select your name on the settings page, then tap on iCloud, iCloud backup, and tap on backup now to upload all your data to your Apple ID. After backup is complete, swipe down for the control center and tap and hold the power button to shut down your iPhone device. Now you will need a Mac or a Windows PC with iTunes installed on it. If you are using a Windows PC, open iTunes and follow the next step. No need of iTunes on Mac. Now connect your Mac or PC to your iPhone using the cable provided in the box and quickly press and hold the power button until the Apple logo disappears and recovery mode is enabled on your iPhone. Tap on allow to connect your iPhone device and update window will pop up. Tap on cancel and select the restore iPhone option under the iPhone recovery mode. Select restore and update option. Tap on next. Tap on agree. And your Mac or PC will start downloading the latest iOS 17 software for your iPhone. The download and update speed will depend upon your internet speed. So make sure you are connected to strong Wi-Fi network. This process will take some time and Apple logo will appear and disappear for a few times. Do not disconnect the cable from the iPhone or the Mac or PC for entire process. And after some time, iPhone restoration complete notification will pop up. Tap on OK and wait for your iPhone to restart. Do not disconnect your iPhone yet, but the steps on your Mac or PC are complete. After some time, the iPhone will turn on for the setup process. Now follow all the steps to restore all your iPhone data. Swipe up and select your language and country from the list. Tap on continue for appearance and select setup without another device. Connect your iPhone to your Wi-Fi network and then it will take some time to activate your iPhone device. Now log in using the same Apple ID which you used before the downgrade process or unlock using the iPhone passcode. I chose passcode, then tap on continue, set up for myself, set up later, and create a passcode to unlock your iPhone. And now is the important step, select from iCloud backup and sign in with your Apple ID. Tap on agree and select the backup which you created before the downgrade process. Tap on continue. Select Don't Continue with Beta Program and Welcome page will pop up on the screen. Swipe up and your iPhone will be downgraded to the latest iOS 17 software. To show you the proof, let's go to the Settings, General, About, and here you can see that the iPhone is running on the latest iOS 17 software update. And if you open the Photos app, all your data will be downloaded on your device using the backup which we created earlier. You will have to log in back to your banking or other Gmail apps for security reasons. If you found this video helpful, make sure to subscribe to TechLoper for more such iPhone tech perks that works. See you over there.